Thank you so much for this lovely thing. Now I'd like to call Divine Education Gurukul students to dance.
end up. Uh, I found what I was searching for, and I found my path. In the beginning, there was still a lot of things I had planned, planning to go for traveling, traveling here and there, but everything just vanished. And um, those experiences, they mean nothing anymore. Even though I'm from a different background, and it has not always been easy to leave my whole life behind. Um, and I think about two years ago, when I was still home, it feels like a past life. And that's exactly how it is, because here it's like a rebirth. And it's the very first place where I ended up, and also my last. And for this I feel very blessed that I already found it. And this Arshan and you as a whole, and the world for me, they have been very much supporting my transformation. It's really like a rebirth. And without this offering of you and your family, who offered a lot, who gave me the guidance and accept me to stay here, I would not be anything of what I am today. So today we are offering things, but these are too small to express the gratefulness and to offering cannot be expressed by just some flowers and chanting. Because everything that I am today is by the grace of all my seen and awesome goals. And the real offering is that I am following your footsteps and to continue this tradition wherever I may go. So today I want to dedicate everything that I have gotten back to the resources where they came from. I have faith in you and in this path, and I have, um, I have the confidence, confidence to say that my life is now under your control. The main program for today is the Guru Puja, Guru Purnima, worshiping, dedicating to the Guru. We all have Guru, and everyone has Guru, and every creature on this planet has Guru, the leader who guides them, even the aunt. They follow with their guru. Even the bee, there is a guru. In any creature or anything else we see, there is a leader, there is a master who guides the second generation. So guru is that light who guides us towards perfection, towards the enlightenment. And today is the auspicious day. There are many yogis, many traditions has developed from today. The main one, the main guru is Adi Guru. Adi Guru is Lord Shiva. Shiva taught on the Gauri Shankar Himalaya. There are two main Himalayas are very popular. One is Mount, De Mount Kailash, the bigger one. The second is Gauri Shankar, which is in Nepal. Gauri is a mother Parvati name. Shankar is Shiva. So Gauri Shankar is the Shiva Sakti Himalaya. So on that Himalaya, Lord Shiva himself in the, in the name of Dakshana Murti. In the name of Dakshana Murti, for he meditated there and he taught to Ma Parvati, Gauri and other Saptarsi, seven rishis who were benefited by the direct teaching of Lord Shiva. This is one, this is the day. This is one proof that we are celebrating Guru Purnima. Second, who promoted the Vyasa, Veda? He was Veda Vyasa. Krishna Dopain, his name is Krishna Dopain. So he took birth today on this Asar Purnima. Vaishak Zet Asar, third month of the calendar. Vaishak Zet Asar, third month. Purnima, on this day. Who has promoted, who has expanded the Veda? Veda Vyasa got birth today. So, this is why it is also called Vyasa Purnima. Veda Vyasa Purnima. And there are many yogis, many rishis who took birth today, who got enlightenment today, who has started their teachings today. And the third one is Lord Buddha. Today's Purnima, he taught his first lesson. He got enlightenment on the Vaishak Purnima, the first month of the new calendar, Vaishak Purnima, which was two months before, birthday, enlightenment day. But this Purnima, he has started his first lecture, first teachings on us. So, Guru Purnima. So, Shiva himself, Vedivyasa, Lord Buddha, everywhere, everyone has taught, took birth on this auspicious day. And today we are 
are celebrating, remembering our all gurus, including Shiva from the very beginning and our masters who have shown us the path. And for us, our tradition, all trace back all the way to Shankaracharya. Shankaracharya is there are many traditions, many systems as there. A yogic system, Swami Shivananda has adapted from Rishikesh. Shivananda, he gave this knowledge to his disciple Swami Satyananda Saraswati, Paramahamsa, Swami Satyananda Saraswati. And Swami Satyananda Saraswati has passed this knowledge to his disciple Swami Niranjananda Saraswati. And I have taken initiation from Swami Niranjananda Saraswati in the name of Indra Giri and continued further education with Swami Shivalingam Saraswati. So this is our tradition. So today we are offering our devotion to the Gurus who have shown us the path, other Rishis, ultimately Lord Shiva, and finally the light within us. May we enlighten, may we find the light within us. By the grace of Guru, without the blessing of Guru, we cannot achieve anything else in this path. So today is our day to show our dedication devotion towards the Gurus. So may we have the blessing of Guru. First of all, may we have the compassion devotion to Guru. Once we have the devotion, definitely Guru will give us the light and the strength.
Just like me.